just before we start this video, please know that this is a very emotional video, and that if you're sensitive to that sort of stuff, then you should probably click off this video right now. So guys, welcome back to a new video, and you already already know what the title's about. Um, but yeah, I just, I was going to put this off because I didn't want to make it, but I felt like today's the, the today's the day where I'm going to cry most about it because we got the news today. Um, I know, um, uh, I don't know, this is hard because, I, I, as you guys know, I'm a huge fan of them. Neil especially. And as you know, I drum, and I drum a lot of their songs. Um, and... I just want to make a video about this. I mean, it had to happen at some point. <laughs> and it happens to everyone. I made up this rhyme. Hold on, let me find it. Where is it? Okay. Everyone lives, everyone dies, everyone cries when their idol dies. Which is true, because everyone does do that, unless you're a heartless soul. Wait, that doesn't even make sense. Uh, but yeah, um, it's just got everyone thinking, uh, now that Neil's died, everyone's just thinking, who's next? And I don't want any of them to die ever. But it's a part of life. And, uh, I know my friend Dustin, um, made this video before me. I was recording another video that I'm then not even going to upload because I just, I just, I start, I was like 10 minutes and it was a Geometry Dash video and I got the notification from him for making the video and I just started crying. So I just stopped the video and deleted it and now I have space here. But I'm just telling you guys that, that it happened. It actually happened three days before today. But on Tuesday, January 7th, which, if, if my calculations are correct, that's the uh, same day that David Bowie died a few years ago. Uh, but yeah, uh, I was wearing a Rush shirt that day. I'm not wearing a Rush shirt now because I was I already wore all my Rush shirts because I got four. Well, I, I got four, na four now. And I wanted to wear something. My other shirt that I got for Christmas for my fifth day uh, of new shirts, so I wore my yes shirt. But, uh, I was wearing my Roll the Bones t shirt that I got for Christmas. The Rush Roll the Bones album cover stuff. So, yeah, uh,. I'm just, just really sad, and I know Anne's out there. Honestly, I bet most people are just upset because I'm upset. Like, I bet, like, I bet more than half the people watching this video, which is not very much, people are going to watch this video, are probably only upset because, um, because, um, Because I'm upset, man. 
they're like me when when the person um the person that I loved and respected for so long just I mean, I mean everyone has to go at some point but like I don't know. I was just sixty-seven. Is like he was sixty-seven. He was pretty young for people who random just randomly start having problems with their self. Usually, people start having problems with their self when they're in their seventies. And also, I think like two. I think like the day after Neil P Neil Peer died, it was Jimmy Page's. 76th birthday. So yeah, he was. But yeah, he was. Uh, he was a good person, and <laughs> we'll forever miss you.